Hey, what's up, guys? Quick car wash due to the snow this week. Terrible. The car is all filthy, so we're gonna take it to a car wash, and I'll show you guys how we wash our cars. All right. Got to the car wash and our car is so dirty due to the snow. We had a lot of snow over the weekend or last week. So here's the result of it. It's more worse in the back though. So we got your wheel cleaner there. We'll start off with the wheel, Speed Masters wheel cleaner. This is good for when you're cleaning the inside of the barrel. This is the face of the wheel, just a generic wheel brush. This is for the tire and the wheel well, scrubbing all that salt off. The wheel cleaner itself is from Chemical Guys, Diablo Gel Wheel Cleaner. All of this is good stuff. I've been using it for four years now. Awesome stuff. We'll go ahead and do the high pressure rinse. Why I love this brush is that it's bendable so that you can get it behind the spokes here. Yeah. And we're gonna go clean the face of the wheel. Uh, don't forget your uh, your love nuts in there. Forget all these crevices right here. The wheels are done, so we're gonna rinse it off. Alright, we're gonna do the next fun part. We're gonna rinse the car, get it all washed out. Two bucket system. The reason why two bucket system is that you can rinse off the dirt and then continue washing so that you don't uh, scratch up your paint. So the product that I use to get a car wash is this guy. Dirt gloss car wash. We're gonna get this started. It's gonna take me at least two hours to clean it, and the results is gonna be fire. I use ONR No Rinse Car Wash to get all the water soft and break down all the dirt. Of course, I have it in a pre soaked bottle with these uh, measurements here. So I'll link everything up in the description down below so you guys can follow what I do. These, these are grit guards. This dirt collects in the bottom of the bucket. This guy stays at the bottom and all the dirt stays on the bottom of the bucket. So I got these buckets filled up. So right now we're gonna put this bad boy. Love this guy. I recommend this brand a lot. Car wash concentrate is bomb. So yeah. So when I'm washing the cars, I like to work from the top to the bottom. The number one tip is to lift up your wipers. I always forget that, so. So then again, this car is filthy due to the snow. So I'm gonna rinse it off very hard. To wash off the roof. Step on that. So right now I'm spraying down the car with the ONR solution to get this the dirt all softened up and it helps a lot cleaning up the car so you don't have to do a lot of effort. I've got two towels. The yellow towel is for the top half, black towel for the bottom half of the car. The bottom of the car is mostly dirty at the top. 
So you have a different towel. So you have all of the crud with the different towel and then the gold towels from the top. So it's much more cleaner. So you don't have to cross contaminate with the dirt with the other uh, mitt. So that's how I wash the car. Don't forget to get the bottom of your fenders right here. Ah. The bottom half of the car is so filthy. We're gonna do that last. So we're gonna wash the top half first and wash the bottom half. I'll show you how the back is so dirty. Don't forget the exhaust kit. Another tip to wash your windshield wipers. Don't forget this little wiper too. Alright, everything is all cleaned up so we're gonna go final rinse. Another tip is to wet the uh, towel. It's gonna be easier to wipe off everything against the wet paint. Of course, you gotta spray it on the car too. Oh my God. I'm gonna show you guys how great this towel is. Look at that. So good. So I got four of these. So this is a big car. So it's gonna need more towels. I so love this towel. Alright, it's getting busy at the car wash, so we gotta pack things up to the house to finish everything off. There's a few more things that I do and tighten. Alright guys, just got to the house, just finished uh, eating breakfast and we're gonna finish off cleaning up the RAV4s. So, so. What I like to do, cleaning up the door jams. All of this water residue is still there. Here, right there. And then of course at the, on the door itself here, you can see some water spots there. All the way around to the bottom and there too. Of course it's uh, all at four doors. And of course at the back. All of this. Corner right here, corner at the door. We're gonna take a um, not so good quality microfiber towel. We're gonna be wiping all the door jams. I'm gonna do a quick wipe down of the door jams. Of course, I put uh, this wax again on that uh, yellow microfiber here. Yeah. See how much water gets in here. This is why I take hours for cleaning up a car. Oh, oh. Like this little piece right here. Always wipe down your door jams after washing your car. Also, another area you guys need to watch out for is your uh, gas door. See? Oh, the water. Alright, after I'm done with the door jams, I like to get started on the window. So, what I start using is this guy does a pretty good job you get your your glass cleaner towel which i kind of don't like these because it lints up so i'm trying to look for another um, glass cleaning towel so if you guys know a good glass cleaning towel let me know another tip that i like to do when cleaning your windows are to lower down your windows and lower it down so you can wipe on the top of the window when you're you're wiping your windows you need to wipe this stuff here when you guys roll up your guys window after cleaning the top of the window look what happens water that's why it takes a while to wash the car don't forget the rear windshield as well now we're gonna get the vacuum cleaner and saw all the dirt off
So check out this setup. Oh, so weird. We have the other attachment that came with the vacuum. I'm gonna use the, the skinny side of this attachment to get through hard to clean areas. So I'm gonna switch this attachment to get your general cleaning done. Wipe down the interior with just this cloth, nothing to it. That's that. So once you're done, might want to take out the car out, put it under the sun, and the Mario works. It's very clean. No shining. That's how I wash the RAV4. So let me know if you guys have any uh, comments down below. I'm gonna respond to it as soon as I can. All of the products that I use washing the RAV4 is in the description box. Hope you guys enjoyed it. So make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. And until next time, it's your boy Juicy for another vlog, baby. Woo wee! Yeah!